Hey guys, welcome to our channel and in today's video I will show you how to add additional variation images to products in WooCommerce. Plugins for WP. WordPress premium plugins and themes for an affordable price. Okay, so I created this product for our example. It's a granola bar that comes in three different flavors. We have chocolate, vanilla and peanut butter. Obviously the wrap is in a different color. However, because it's different flavor, the ingredient of the product also different and the calories, the nutrition facts are also different. So now when I choose vanilla, I would like to see the back of this bar to see how many calories there are in this vanilla bar and how many calories in the peanut butter bar and what the nutrition facts of each of them. And we need to add additional images to each variation. We can definitely do it with the WooCommerce extension called Additional Variation Images. You can get it from the official website for total price of $49 or from us, the exact same plugin for only $4.99. Again, it's the exact same plugin for 90% off, which is amazing. Alternatively, if you have our plugin manager installed on your WordPress website, just go to the back end of your website into Plugins for WP and here search for the desired plugin. In our case, it's additional variation images. You can see it over here, click on install. And once you're done, click on activate. Once activated, the plugin is ready to be used. You don't need any special modification or customization. You can definitely use it out of the box. So let's click edit on the product with the different variations. And we'll scroll down to the variations tab. And I already created the three variations that I showed you. It's the chocolate, vanilla, and peanut butter. Now we can expand each of the variation. We can see uh, the feature image of that specific variation, plus the link to add additional images. So let's click on it. And to this variation, the chocolate variation, I will add the back wrap of the specific variation. Same for the vanilla, I will add the back wrap of the vanilla variation. And also for the peanut butter, I will do the same. I will add additional image uh, with the nutrition facts of the peanut butter variation. I will save the changes and I will click on update. Once I did, I will revisit the page one more time. And I can see all the images over here as I saw before. However, now when I choose a different variation such as vanilla, I will see the added images that we added just a second ago, which is the back of the granola bar. Same for the peanut butter and same for the chocolate as well. All right, guys, so thank you very much for watching this video. Please uh, leave a comment and let me know if you have any questions regarding this process. Please also like it, share it with your friends and subscribe to our channel because there are more great videos on the way. I will see you all in the next video.